Rotrop project. Your task, plan a road trip, starting in UAE, then taking the following directions. So we have seven countries and we're going to make seven stops to each country. From the UAE, we're going to go to India and then from India to China, China to Egypt, Egypt to Spain, Spain to Morocco, Morocco to Brazil, and then Brazil back to the UAE. So we have this coordinate plane and it's just the point of every country on the coordinate. The first task is find the coordinates of each country that you will visit using the given map. So what we're going to do here is, let's say the UAE, you're going to go back to the slide. Here is the UAE and you're going to find the coordinates of it. So here is zero. We're going to count one, two, three, four, five. So the UAE is between five and six. So 5.5 and then we're going to go up one, two. Again, it's between two and three. So 2.5 and you're going to write here in brackets 5.5 comma 2.5 and so on for the rest of the countries the second task is to find the distance between we have UAE and India India and China China and Egypt Egypt and Spain Spain and Morocco Morocco and Brazil and Brazil and UAE so what we're going to do here is find the coordinates in this slide of the UAE and India. We're going to write it down and then we're going to write the formula of the distance. So we're going to write the distance formula and solve it using the distance formula. And you're going to do that to every country. Last but not least, we have find the midpoint of, we have UAE, India, India and China, China and Egypt and so on, just like the last one. What you're going to do here is write the coordinates of both countries and then you're going to write down the midpoint formula and solve it using the midpoint formula. You're going to do that to every country. Now we have the grading rubric. So if you want to get full marks, which is 20, you need to show all your work using the distance formula and you're going to write the work of each question of the time that you use it. This is formula must be used to minimum of five times and you have to show all your work using the midpoint formula and write the midpoint formula for each example you use it. Midpoint formula must be used a minimum of five times. But if you want, if you'll get 19 to 18, it one of the required exercises is wrong or incomplete. And from 17 to 16, two of the required exercises are wrong or complete. And 15 to 18, 11, 3 or 4 of the required exercises are wrong or incomplete and 10 or below it's incomplete the distance and the midpoint formulas are not written or used enough times multiple parts are left incomplete or are calculated incorrectly clear lack of attention to detail and that is it for the math term one final assessments and thank you